Nadia Sawala, 57, will not be attending this evening's NTAs after suddenly falling ill, but that didn't stop the Loose Women star speaking out about the awards. The actress-turned-panelist pleaded for her fans to vote for the ITV show, while snubbing this morning, in a bid to take the gong from their rivals. Nadia took to Instagram to post a video of herself in a last-minute bid for Loose Women as she called for her 521,000 followers to vote. She exclaimed, Morning everybody! Yes, it's miserable Cinderella not going to the NDAs tonight. But do you know what? It would be really BL die nice if we won. Come on! Nadia then snubbed the usual winners of the Best Daytime Show category, this morning, hosted mainly by Holly Willoughby and Philip Schofield. Taking aim at the show, she continued, every year it's the same winners. You'll probably get in trouble with ITV for saying that. But you know it's true, isn't it? Wouldn't it be nice to see all the girls running up there? Honestly though. I'm going to be so by depressed if I'm sat here not there and they win. Wouldn't it be nice to see the girls lifting the trophy? Maybe they'll be a bit naughty on the stage. Come on, let's mix it up a bit. Let's have something different going on at the NTAs today. Go on. Loose women are up against the chase. The Repair Shop and This Morning for the Best Daytime Show Phil and Holly previously have been voted for several presenter awards, but were snubbed from this year's nominations, apart from their show, This Morning, being nominated for the Best Daytime Gong yet again. The hosting duo, who also present Dancing on Ice together, are usually staples in the list of nominations for TV presenter. This year marks the first time since 2017 that neither Holly or Phil have been considered for a presenting award. ITV bosses are said to be considering increasing security for Holly Willoughby and Philip Schofield at the upcoming NDAs. This comes after the heavy criticism the pair received over allegations they jumped the queue to see the late Queen lying in state, after other celebs including David Beckham and ITV star Susanna Reid stood in line for hours to pay their respects. Holly and Phil have been slammed by viewers in the wake of the claims and a petition to have the duo fired from their presenting roles hit more than 75,000 signatures in just over a week. This morning then released a statement defending the presenting duo in hopes to stop the online abuse. The statement read, Hello everyone, we would like to clarify something. We asked Philip and Holly to be part of a film for this Tuesday's program. They did not jump the queue, have VIP access or file past the Queen lying in state but instead were there in a professional capacity as part of the world's media to report on the event. With this in mind, Loose Women and other nominees may have more of a chance in winning the best daytime show gong, 